counter. Let's check you out. This cookie is completely smashed. So I'm just going to pull it out, okay, because it's completely broken. So possibly something's going to be exposed that's going to be coming mm -hmm. for you. That's going to be a wish, okay, that you've wanted, all right? So Urban Dictionary, quick lit. I don't know what that is. So you might want to check that out, and that's relevant. So your numbers are for uh, lotto or whatever, 43, 44, 46, 35, 4, 25. Lots of stability, lots of fours. You have the ability to touch the lives of so many people. All right, so most definitely you are a cancer. So anyway, so 4-4 four, four on the clock. Shadow, I think you've done a lot of shadow work. I think emotional withdrawal. I think you emotionally withdrew, really meditated, and really worked on the night, dark night of the soul or your shadow side. So huge, huge uh, elevation and ascension, all right, that you're doing or you have done. Movement, choices, decisions. So lots of decisions, lots of portals coming in, lots of opportunities, possibly a marriage and or possibly an engagement, or this could be a, um, coming together in terms of partnership and business. Lots of growth and healing of the heart. Okay, lots of fourth chakra. So lots of speaking and most definitely lots of money. So grounding all this money energy. Yeah, solar plexus most definitely coming into your power. All right, and um, shooting star, accelerated motion. Exactly what I told you. Um, huge communication coming in. This is your north north node as well. So north north uh, star. You might live near the mountains or might have overcome lots of challenges. Okay, this has to do. I think there might be some like major things coming in. Like I think that the starling came in. I think there's also like uh, meteorites or like um, I don't know like something coming in. So that's gonna be your cue that it's coming coming into huge huge balance. All right, I love it most definitely. All right, let's move along. Let's see what your tarot says. Please like, share, and subscribe. I would love for you to help me grow my channel. So let's see. So we have here Queen of Water. You're it. <laughs> Cancer. And then you have Eight of Water. So possibly um, you walked away from something, okay, or walking away from something. Higher font into something that's more committed. This can also, this also seems to me like the High Priestess, so hugely elevated. This also seems like you have everything here, and it's sort of like the Magician. So lots of uh, changes in terms of uh, alchemizing and manifesting what you want. This is also using your Moon Cycle. So you have Moon here, and you have, you know, Water. So most definitely, this is your reading, okay? You might have Pisces in your in your um in your chart the interesting thing about this is that this looks like a star and this looks like a star so something having to do very like with divinity okay or a huge wish fulfillment and lots of healing coming in this is archangel also um maybe uh helping you out and protecting you this is uh federal agencies government issues higher commitments structures religion uh, spirituality anything that is uh formal okay and very structured is coming in and i think you've been manifesting this i think that there might be some sort of like uh potion or some sort of like spell work that you did that's coming in finally into fruition okay and i think that you've seen the light to this all right so you have here hang mound and it was in reverse so highly highly intuitive you have most definitely leveled up with this okay you have an angel here this looks like an angel so this is a huge ascension that you've been going through and this is something divine okay this is something that was sort of destined because you have these like stars all right and then you have three of water so huge collaboration lots of celebration i think there might be some sort of parties or celebrations that are coming in and then you have the ten of fire so this is all burdens that are really gonna that you've completely released and burned okay you might also be working on a novel or some sort of confirmation it says full moon the moon has moved to sagittarius it's not full moon but anyway so lots of forward movement by december is going to be significant if you're working on a um, a book i recommend that you keep on working 433 on the clock so lots of stability having to do with collaboration and then eight of waters is something that you walked away from okay really is going to give you a huge opportunity and like a chest full of like uh, prosperity so you walking away whatever you walked away with that i think was very very hard 
really is going to get you in like an incredible situation. 455 on the clock. So lots of changes in terms of stability. Ace of water. You're going to be so, so loved and you're going to be given um, like an offer of love, but most definitely you're going to feel incredibly loved. And then this is the call most definitely. So I think you feel there's a call to something. Someone might be calling you, okay, that has to do with some sort of relationship. This can also be like very much, very much divinely guided and you might be an earth angel. Okay. So love and light five to five on the clock. When I said that lots of changes having to do with you, your stability and your partnership, love and light. Ciao.